was a lame high five. Dude, lame high five. Are we live? Yeah, you're live, man. Oh, we are live. We're so is this live. Facebook live Joseph. or is this YouTube oh, live? No. What's up, dude? What's up, Joe? Good morning. Good morning. This is seriously my more. This is it. This is the intro for the vlog right here. Oh, this is the intro this for the, the vlog. This is the intro for the vlog. So, okay. Hey, hey, hey. Hey, hey, hey. This is the intro for the vlog. Hey, hey, hey. This is the intro for the vlog. Hey, hey, hey. This is the intro for the vlog. Hey, hey, hey. This is the intro for the vlog. Hey, hey, hey. This is the intro for the vlog. Hey, hey, hey. This is the intro for the vlog. Hey, hey, hey. This is the intro for the vlog. Hey, hey, hey. This is the intro for the vlog. Hey, hey, hey. This is the intro for the vlog. Hey, hey, hey. But you have Two. to have Guys. something cliche, like... Yo! Hey guys, how's it going? Hey, I just wanted to talk about the thought of the day. And since all day today... Sorry, squirming. Heard me, I'm talking. All day, I was... Fellowshipping. I was spending time with uh, people from the church, my brothers and sisters in Christ. And uh, the new converts and everybody. I just had a good time. Uh, laughed. Had good, clean fun. Uh, we had a softball softball game and a ping pong tournament and game night and uh, it was crazy everybody was having a good time and Jay was with their family having to fun with them and Hurley he was uh, just home alone all day long yep uh-huh he's the You're man a the grown house. man the grown man all day no I'm just kidding he was not home we're gonna get in trouble the IS what is they called the IS CP the CPA you gonna call CPA CPS the CPS is no, gonna come after us because they watched my vlog Anyways, I had a great time, and I wanted to talk about fellowship. I had a scripture. Oh, I believe it's First Thessalonians 5.11. Therefore, comfort each other and edify one another, just as you also are doing. I keep skipping also. Um, but anyways, guys, that just really brings... I had a thought. I just I slipped my mind. Whoop! Oh, yeah. So, something I say to people who repent and accept Jesus into their life, I always tell them, hey, like, find a local church or find a church and plant yourself in it and surround yourself with uh, Christian brothers and sisters that, that'll start to care for you and you'll build a relationship with them. I always tell them it's very important, like, I explain it to them and I say, hey, when you went to high school, um, you saw there was groups, you know, there was football people. If you wanted to play football, you'd hang out with the football players. If the jocks, the drugs, the jocks, you would hang out with the jocks. Not drugs, no drugs. I usually don't say drugs. Um, if you wanted to skate, you know, learn more about skating and stuff. Guess who you hung out with? The chess club skater team. Boys. No, I'm just kidding. Not chess club team. The skater boys. Um, and even the smart people. You know, you'd probably hang out with the people who were in. Uh, what are the fancy classes called? Honor. Honors. I, you could tell I wasn't an honor. Anyways, um, so I always tell people, like, look, if you want to live for God and you want to find out who you are in Christ Jesus and really believe it and start to, you know, if you want to do something for God, um, surround yourself with people who are doing something for God. And so I always emphasize it. It's very important. And so that's what I'll leave with you guys today. Say bye, baby. Bye. No, I was talking to that baby. <laughs> say bye. Not you. Okay, wife, you could say bye. Okay, sorry. Bye. I said wife! <laughs> <laughs>
<laughs> Just kidding. Bye, guys. Deceiver that could change my mind